So is there, uh, can you tell us a little about the history of this business? Well, we started in, uh, on a farm in uh, northern Chester County in uh, 1986. So we're in uh, our 32nd or 33rd year of business. Um, and, uh, you know, we were on the farm for about seven years in a small farm store, and then we moved into the little town of Kimberton, and that's where we came up with our name of Kimberton. And because we sell, uh, you know, whole food type products, we called ourselves Kimberton Whole Foods. And um, that was in 1994. Uh, we had added a second store in 2003, a third store in 2007 came to Ottsville in 2008 um, and uh, invited up by the owner of the Brigadoon coffee shop who was you know a great partner for us because he had the, the coffee shop which he still does which is fantastic uh, and we've been here for the last ten and a half years and we just grew the business so much uh, in this community that we'd run out of space and so with uh, Glenn Neby uh, who owns this the shopping center in this area uh, we got talking a couple years ago and he um, uh, asked how big a store we wanted that would include Serafina's Cafe. Uh, we said, how about, because I think he had, was able to do 15,000 square feet. We said that would be great and two years later, here we go. So it's, uh, um, you know, we've, we've uh, uh, our, you know, our primary focus, although we sell a little bit of every food category or a lot of every food category is to support local businesses, local vendors, local farmers and uh, you know proud to say that we probably have over 200 local companies that we work with. So um, working with local companies can you tell us a little bit about your commitment and connections with the local farmers? Well we've developed, I mean we came from a farm we started out as uh, on a 400 acre organic um, dairy farm so that was our roots and the reason we had the farm store was to try to help the farm break even because the farm was losing a lot of money um, and not only did we have the farm store then we created a yogurt product which we sell called seven stars yogurt which is the number one selling um, uh, yogurt in the mid-atlantic region in the in the natural foods channel so it's since we've left, it's gotten bigger and bigger, and it's still made on the farm. So, so of course, we have that relationship because it's just a couple of miles from our main store.